This week we're at La Jolla High School, and this is one of the most famous 18 stair rails in Southern California. Damn it, they knobbed the top of it. No way, did they? Yeah. I actually wanted to skate it today. Really? You were gonna skate it, huh? Yeah. A feeble's looking pretty good right now. Dang. But unfortunately, because of these knobs, we will not see Kane and Feeble this rail today. Yeah, Feeble. Back 50's also looking pretty good. Back 50? Yeah. All right, well, what all has been done on this thing, Cannon? Who was the first to skate it? <laughs> I think we all know that. Jamie Thomas, misled youth. He did board slide. Lip slide, fakie. My only friend, and Smith. Friend. In 1999. I was just a baby. <laughs> <laughs> I was nine years old. <laughs> I was like four. That Smith grind was iconic, huh? Oh yeah, he put it on a zero board. It was the, the Smith grind board. Those things go for a lot on eBay if you got one. One of the original, not yeah, the reprints. Yeah. There's like three or four different editions. Yeah, there's like there's a gold like one, a blue one, a green one. Yeah. I think there's a pink one too. It's a sick graphic. Yeah. Who was the first one to 50-50 this thing? I'm sure Jamie did that too. <laughs> but I know Louis Lopez did it in his uh, extremely sorry part. He was probably only like I don't know what, 11, 12 yeah, at the time. Yeah, he definitely looked young Pretty, in that video. That's still crazy today for an 11 or 12 year old to do. Absolutely. And then Alfonso Rawls in, I think 2001, he did Feeble. Front board. And no slide down this rail. Love a big nose slide. Another good one is Figgy came here and 5 0 it in his birdhouse part. And then came back a few years later and did front salad. He one upped himself. Geez, they went crazy with the Bondo. Oh my God, look how much they went over here. Dang. Like this whole strip is like eight feet, 10 feet long. I guess they opened the doors and wanted this whole path to come through to hit one of these rails. That sucks they put this fence here. Yeah, this fence used to not be here, huh? Yeah, if you're regular skating front side, I mean, it's definitely still skatable, but it's not a whole lot of run up. Yeah. It's pretty low. For an 18 stair, this is a nice one. Yeah, perfectly mellow. Yeah. It's like not too mellow and it's not too steep. Some other tricks that have been done, uh, Ryan Smith crooked it. I think that was his last part in Dying to Live. Yeah, if I'm it correct. was his last trick. Tommy Sandoval nose grinded it. Another crazy one that went down, Alex Wilms did front feeble. And then a really unique trick, Pedro Delfino did boneless 50-50 down this. You don't see that one every day. <laughs> yeah, that's a crazy one. Down an 18 stair. Yeah, boneless onto this thing. If you want to skate this side rail, you only got one knob, the OG knobs. Oh yeah. Yeah, you just have to grind that down. It's like not even that bad. You can tell that they used to have those other knobs all the way down, but they've been removed at least once. And then I guess they put these newer knobs back on. Huh. I think Adam tried to ollie the set on this. Really? 18 yeah. stair ollie, that, that's sick. Over the rail. Wow, that's even sicker. It might've been in like the damn it all intro or something. Then after that, Chris Dobstaff did blunt slide to fakie. And Chase Webb did nose blunt down this thing. This one's crazy. Nigel backsmith this thing. And he also took a gnarly slam trying it and ended up on Hall of Meat. Oh 
Yeah, he clipped on the way in. Yeah, that was heavy. Honestly, it, it could have been a lot worse. He's lucky like he caught the rail. Yeah, for sure. I mean, it, I'm sure it was still really sucked. I found this YouTube clip of this dude named Daniel. He tried to board slide this thing and he just got bodied at the bottom. I want to <laughs> see it, but I don't. Nijah also did front blunt fakie for one of his X Games real street parts. I heard he had to come back multiple times for that one. They kept getting kicked out. Check it out. You see all these video cameras all over this school? Now you're on camera. Guess what? Now we're coming after you. I told you three times. Right. Now we're calling the police. Call the cops and wait till they get here. And then Nyjah came back and did fakey grind. And Nolly and Nose grind. Those are definitely two of the craziest tricks that have been done on this thing. Like I could not imagine popping fakey into this thing. Nolly makes a little more sense, but it still doesn't make sense. But yeah, he got the cover of Thrasher for that fakey grind. That's a trick you don't see every day, especially not down an 18 stair. Yeah. I think that's everything. Did we cover it all? You guys know any more tricks that we missed out? Yeah, leave a comment if you know another trick that's been done on this thing. Those are the ones we know about, but Maybe there's another one or two that we missed. Yeah, like has somebody firecrackered it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> now it's time for you to tell us what would have to be done to make this skatable again. I think it's an easy one to tell everyone. Yeah, this one's easy because you only got two knobs to take off depending on which rail you want to skate. You're just going to take your grinder, grind here, grind here, maybe a little right there, and then you just knock it off. We don't encourage this behavior, but you know, people got to do what they got to do to make things skatable. Yeah. <laughs> should we skate around and see what else is skatable at this school? Yeah, we definitely should. I know there's a couple more small spots that we can mess around at. I think there's one more big spot too. Is there? And over here we got some nice little banks to skate. This is sick. Nice. And you get a nice hill bomb after. Sick. Look who decided to show up. What do we have here? I wonder if anyone's skated this huge double set. I mean, the, the run ups at an angle, you pretty much have to go over the rail. This is knobbed, but I don't know who's hitting this thing. Yeah. If anyone knows of anyone that has skated this double set, let us know in the comments below. So, six flat six. Is there anything to skate in here? Um, I mean, there's like some three stairs. They got the, the good buttery benches over there, some knobbed ledges. This ledge would be sick to skate. Too bad they knobbed it. Dalton, see if you can skate it anyways. Wow. Oh! Look at this crazy thing right here. Triple set. Take off the rail and take off the knobs. You got a nice hubba. All right, looks like Dalton's gonna go for this rail. Nice. nice. Oh, and the front board. It's kind of crazy. It's like steep. Dude, this thing is super steep. <laughs> I'm not doing that. Nice. Ho oh ho! -ho. 
Nice. Got a little eight stair King Cubba. Nice. We got Schilling's wax. Shout out to Schilling's. They hooked it up with wax for us. Yes. Oh. That's Maryland's right there. Yeah, Maryland's middle. We did a video on the 14 stair over there. It's right there across the street from La Jolla High. You can warm up at the 14 rail and then come to the 18 rail. After you just you. gotta de-knot both. <laughs> <laughs> what is that, like an eight stair down here? We're at the main entrance now. Uh, yeah, seven or an eight. I don't think it's worth climbing this gate because it looks like anything that you can skate in there is definitely knob. Ian, what's up, dude? That's me. My, my homie got the wall ride off that thing right there. Oh, really? He did wall ride on this corner. There's this set. Nice. <laughs> You're probably the first person to skate that. Nice 11 stair ollie. Yeah. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> that was the craziest looking front board I've ever seen. I think that's a good way to end the video right there. Dang, blood on the scene, huh? And that's our video on the La Jolla High School 18 stair rail. If you like this one, give us a subscribe and check out our other spot videos. And then let us know in the comments what the next spot we should check out is. Uh, a lot of tricks are filmed from that roof right there. That's a good top angle. Yeah. That definitely looks like a good spot to film. Well, look, I think <laughs> I think someone left a film pad up there. You see that? Oh, uh, yeah, thing? so your knees don't get tired on that gravel up there. That's hilarious. Might be able to come up on that, Dustin. Uh, I got one in my bag, actually. Oh, yeah. Dustin has one of the uh, original Ty Evans camera bags. You can't find those things anymore. I, I used to have one, too, and I sold it, and I've regretted it ever since. I know. I've had it for, like, 15 years. I don't want to get rid of it, but it's starting to fall apart, so I'll have to try and find a new one on eBay someday. Yeah, if there's anyone out there that knows where to get those Ty Evans OGO camera bags, let us know. It's a home run, right? Definitely a home run.